in well, an hour. Well, not only do we usually <laughs> have a lot of people here, another thing that keeps this place quite warm is all the ridiculous amount of technology we have here. And you can't really see it from all the camera angles, but we have obviously multiple cameras. So Alex, so there's there's the best shot so that you can see all the different stuff. You can see there's lights over there. There's, the, we actually have uh, four lights. We have a light up there. Right we above have me. two lights in front of me. And we have a light uh, right by Ian's head there. We also have uh, two cameras here. We have a camera up there. You can actually see it in the shot. It's actually, yep, yeah, as Alex is pointing at it. Oh, there it is. Yep, yeah, and then he's pointing right at the camera. So that's uh, our third camera. We also have a fourth camera, which is the NASA cam that Ian is is uh, right by there that, <laughs> that Ashton likes to make faces into. It's a we, GoPro. We have, it is a GoPro. And we have uh, underneath the desk there, we have a, um, a Mac Pro with 12 cores in it. And we have so many cores. We have so All many there. cores. Much Those cores. are hyper-threaded cores as well. So yeah. if you if you bring up and look at the uh, the uh, the processors, it tells you how much you're using. So it looks like 24 different processors. Sorry, I like you. You're so nerdy. That was like the nerdiest <laughs> Ridiculous thing. Ridiculous I love nerd. it. I love it. And he, that actually, nerd. I believe that Mac also has 36 gigabytes of RAM. That okay, sounds like uh, an excessive amount of RAM. It is an excessive yeah, amount okay, of RAM. Okay, so on the topic of RAM, mm. um, AMD today apparently announced the, their first supercomputing graphics card with oh. a whopping 12 gigs of RAM. Well, the, the new or has or 12 gigs of memory the on the new Mac yeah. Pro, What? The new, the new Mac Pros Give have me. two workstation class yeah, I know. graphics cards that each have 6 gigs of RAM. But, yeah. So this is more than that, but still. It's base level. Yeah. It's fun to go to Apple.com and, and go through the, like, the Mac Pro yeah. Or it shows you how they assemble it all and everything that's yeah. in it. And if you can also see there's four monitors there um, uh, at, at engineering, plus, of course, Ashton's monitor. And then we, we have uh, <laughs> we have an iMac here. My RAM. We have uh, two giant televisions, uh, one for um, showing us so that we can see what you guys are doing. Oh. Well, so what we're doing to you. And then we also have one giant one here uh, uh, like sitting on its side for the chat so we can read the chat while it's going. Plus we also have another television for me to play Desert Bus on, plus a VCR and a Sega CD and, and a, a laptop, laptop and a little camera to be able to um, convert the video off of the Sega CD into a Firewire stream that's plugged into this old black MacBook. <laughs> and actually something that I hacked up yesterday, we actually have uh, um, a video cable running from this camera here, which is the main camera. Oh, there's a good shot showing uh, the stuff. But I ran a video cable from the main camera that runs through the underneath the stairs here and goes back underneath the desk where Ian's at that has uh, an, another video camera that's connected up to that and it's used for a firewire pass through so that we're, the, the, the video camera isn't actually shooting like shots of Ian's feet. It's it just being be. used. It should be. We could do that. It'd be easy to do. No. Don't have to. No. <laughs> yeah. Nope. But it, it, it's being used to pass the video from this camera to Skype. Interesting. So that because I don't know if this is boring, but I find it interesting. It's really nice to acknowledge all the like. You guys need to know how much work went into the setup. Like it's so extensive, so much work, and like Johnny and the whole team. We have our first so meeting. So hard. Yeah, like eight months prior. Yeah. Yep. To, plan to like figure out, and and also remember that this is like. Where where Lur also films half their stuff. So this, it doesn't look like this all this the time. Isn't, this isn't the place we read. It's a, this is the office. This is the office, yeah. And yeah. so it's just, it's like usually if they have to clear everything out, they have to logistically figure out how the cables are going to run. And it's so much work. And I think it's awesome that you can explain it, Johnny, actually, because hmm. a lot of people don't think about that. Mm. Yeah, well, and, and, and we, we don't have a lot more stuff than we've had last year, but it seems like it was quite a lot more complicated. And we do have a new video switch that Ian's been oh. playing with that is awesome. That means mm. that we don't have to do all the camera switching in Cam Twist, so Ian can quickly just press a button mm. and switch mm -hmm. us between mm. three different things. He can do all sorts of cool star wipes and and picture and picture functions right in the switcher, and it's awesome. And Pretty great. We love it. Um, so we have. Uh, there was a question in the chat there for yep. me, uh, which is only just happens to be relevant to something I I know recently, which was Matt. How many push-ups can you do? Um, <laughs> Half a push-up. And no, the answer is getting better because currently, as a part of my workout program, yeah. 
push-ups are one of the exercises How I have How many can do. you do? Uh, not that many I on the grand scheme of I'm things. Gonna... I could do three sets of 15 T push-ups. I bet you that's so, less than a tenth of what Dix can do in the same amount of But yeah, the, oh, Dix all right. would destroy me. Right. Right. Um, well, he's in the army. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. That's all they do. They don't actually <laughs> fight. They just do push-ups and get yelled at all the time. <laughs> right? Oh. Oh, we made this. Pardon? <laughs> what am I looking at? Well, that's <laughs> intense. Wait, what? What is? What am I looking at? That's the root macro batch. Mother of Glob. That's the overlay. That's Ooh. awesome. Oh yeah, there it is. Yes. So pretty. That that is the the um. Oh right, we didn't even talk about the UI. No, we totally didn't do. Um. Well, I I did that uh, with Ian's help. He yep. did, he did all the the information yeah. that is displayed up here, and I did the layout. Um, of all this blue, and that is how it looks like on the back end. It uses a visual programming language called Quartz Composer to create all the visualizations and uh, displays and so forth. So that allows us to pull information from Ashton's API to get um, uh, the, it's, the total, the how much time we've been yeah, running. It's for. also it lets us put Snoop Dogg on there, so yep. we can get him. Oh, you know it. Let's get some dog up in.